makes Microsoft Excel so powerful. You can use formulas to derive results that are dependent upon the data that is entered into the worksheet. If you change the data in the worksheet, then the results of the formulas will change. When a formula is entered into a cell, it performs a calculation and returns the result of that calculation into the cell. Formulas usually refer to other cells that contain data and use that data as components of the formula. If the data in the cells are changed, so will the result of the formula. The use of formulas that refer to worksheet cells for their components allows the formulas to do most of the work when you update the hard-coded data within your worksheet. A formula can consist of the following elements. Mathematical operators, such as a plus sign for addition, cell references, values in text, and worksheet functions such as the sum formula, product formula, quotient formula, etc. Here I'm entering into a cell the equal sign 200 asterisk 0.15. This formula multiplies 200 by 0.15 and will display a result of 30, which is 15% of 200. This formula consists of only values and it does not refer to other cells. Now here I'm entering equals cell B2 plus cell C3. This formula refers to cells B2 and C3 and uses the addition operator to sum the two cells together. Now here I'm entering a function. What I'm going to do is enter the sum function. I'll press equals SUM and then I'll select cells A1 through B4. This function calculates the sum of the values entered into the cell range A1 through B4. I can also enter in my cell range manually by typing in A1 colon B4. The operators in Excel that are used for formulas are the plus sign for addition, the hyphen or negative symbol for subtraction, the forward slash for division, the asterisk for multiplication, the hat symbol for exponential functions, the and symbol for concatenation, the equal symbol for logical comparisons equal to, the greater than symbol for logical comparisons greater than, the less than symbol for logical comparisons that are less than, the greater than combined with the equal symbol for logical comparisons that are greater than or equal to, the less than and equal symbol combined for logical comparisons less than or equal to, and the less than symbol combined with the greater than symbol for logical comparisons to mean not equal to.